Best way to start the morning in the tent. You wake up, you see this beautiful view, and you have your morning coffee. Good stuff. Extra black. So all the gear is packed, and we're going back home to the house. I mean, this camping spot was beautiful. Never been here camping before on just this spot, but it's amazing. Really, really nice. And I can say <laughs> this regular tent is much more practical than the tent sill in the tree tent, but it wasn't as cool of an experience, <laughs> but much more practical, easy to put up and down and much more comfortable to sleep in. <laughs> so yeah, let's go back home and then we're heading back to, to Stockholm today. So we just saw one of the most majestic animals in the world, the eagle here in the archipelago. Uh, we didn't have time to pull up the video camera, but we got some got some pretty cool stills of it. <laughs> Every time I do this, I'm pretty scared of. <laughs> Accelerating a little bit too much and falling into the water. That would be very, that would be very, very bad. It is so beautiful. Such a nice day here in the archipelago just outside of Stockholm and wow you know when I was young I thought I would move away from Sweden move to some other country where it was warm all year round but hey I love Sweden session done for this weekend there's a bit more wavy today a bit bigger swell so I, I took the I took the wider surf ski today to be a little bit more stable but it felt really good kayaks are packed let's go back to Stockholm so we just got back with the car we're unloading all the stuff here into the garage and it's been a good weekend. A lot of training, lots of really good works out, workouts, testing some camping gear, testing the tent and the tree, testing the, the sleeping pads and stuff. So it's, yeah, good weekend. The weekend has been really good and I'm constantly reminded, you know, how, fa how thankful I am for my body that I can do these things. I'm really, I'm really a fake cripple. You know, I can use my legs a little bit, I can walk a little bit with, with crutches and I can do all these things that I really love to do and I'm so thankful for that. You know, I have friends that are paralyzed from like the chest down and not being able to do a lot of things and yeah, I'm just thankful that I can do all these things that I actually can do, even though it's hard sometimes, even though it can be really tough to be in a wheelchair. You know, I'm super thankful for this. And I try to remind myself every day to be thankful for what I have. Because you never know how long it will last. 